Hey, hey. You know, some people often ask, why do you have, why do you do saving challenges and why do you have sinking funds? Well, stick around because I'm fixing to show you why. Hey, hey, how's everybody doing this morning? So this is my second video of the day, but um, I have been stressing about paying bills because if you've been following along, you know that I've been out of work since January because I broke my elbow and short-term disability cannot get their it straight. So I am actually waiting on a check and but until then, I cannot pay my car payment. So, due to my savings challenges, due to my sinking funds, I'm going to be able to do that. I don't want to pull from them, but in order to be on time with my car payment, and that's something that I, you know, greatly, greatly try to do every month is pay my bills on time. Um... I remember way back when I was always behind. But now that I do this, I stay on top of my bills and, you know, decent credit and all that good stuff. But anyway, this is what I'm going to do. Today, I am going to be pulling from my savings challenge binder um, in order to pay my car payment. And once I get that check in from short term or my taxes i will put it back okay so what i'm gonna do is I'm, I'm gonna keep a note of it on what i'm taking out and where i'm taking it out from and i will make sure it gets put back in there so this is my savings challenge binder and i've got this lane here because this is my savings challenge my savings challenges um i color in and i put that money in at the end of the month you'll see this come out again but right now um we're gonna pull to pay my car payment okay and if y'all hear my husband talking he is addicted to monopoly that monopoly app so, <laughs> he's always trying to get stickers, if you know what I'm talking about. All right, so today, my car payment is $4.52 and some change. So, I'm going to pull $4.53, all right? So, first, we're going to go into the 2424s. Now, this actually goes to my grandson's ball binder, which the ball binder is not his, it's the ball binder is for us to, if he has ball out of town, then that's the money we, we use to go out of town, okay? So I'm pulling from the 2424s, 2424s, 50, 100, 20, 40, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68. So I'm pulling $168 from there. Okay, and then I'm going to, I've got little notes over here too. From emergency, I've got 1,190. A thousand of it is in my high yield savings account. I do not want to touch that period. If I absolutely had to, I, I would, but I really don't. So I'm taking the 190 out of here. This is my e-fund. And it should be 190, 20, 40, 60, 81, 50, 60, 70, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90. Okay, so that's 190 out of there. And I'll fill in these later. Car maintenance. Um, I definitely have to put this back in there because our tags are coming due. I do have 200 in my high yield, which would be plenty to pay my tags. 
if needed. So 20, 40, 50, 55. So what I try to do is keep enough in there um, so I don't have to touch that. So 55 there. Y'all don't pay any attention to my handwriting. It's like chicken scratch. And then the last one um, is my debt by, um, envelope 20, 40, 60, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84. Okay, that doesn't really have to go back in there, but I will put it back in there because I want to start doing my snowball um, and get some of these bills off of us. How much did I say, 84? Okay, so that's gonna come up to seven, one, six, seven, 15, 16. 9, 2, 3, 4, 4, 97, which is more than enough, okay? So I may take some back and put back in one of these um, envelopes, but that's more than enough to pay the car payment. Um, but then I may just go ahead and put it in there just so it'll have a little buffer and um, I won't have to worry about it, okay? So this is the whole reasoning behind Saving, saving to sink, okay? We do all of our savings challenges, our March Mini Madness, our $5 Fridays, our Saturday Scratch and Saves. We put all that money aside. And then at the end of, end of the month, we put it into our savings binders, okay? It could be this binder, it could be the ball binder, or it could be our family binder, which holds our um, fa our family, our pet, Christmas, um, date night, holidays, anything like that, okay? So we save to sink. So once we get through saving at the end of the month, we sink it into those binders so that if something like this does come up, we can actually take care of it and not have to worry about it. But I wrote all this down so that when I do get that check back, I will stuff it back in here. All right. So I'm going to get all this money sorted and get it to the bank so that I don't have to worry about my car getting paid for. <laughs> but anyway, that's just a quick little video that I wanted to do and show you guys um, the whole reasoning behind saving money, budgeting, and sinking it into funds that you actually need, you know, in the long run. So that's it, you guys. Thank you for joining in. And um, remember always to like, subscribe, and comment. Say hey, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.